IDX add-on that we've been working on. This is a new piece of software that we've made. It's the Google Map Widget. So what you do is you put in the map coordinates that you want. There's a little, little bit of information. This is what it is. And this shows you how to set it up. And you can get your Google key if you want to use um, your own Google API key. But it shows you how to look up the, uh, the map coordinates. So anyway, once you get those, you put them in here. This is actually set up for the Charlottesville Airport. And once you, you can also come in here and select a map that from SNAZI Maps. So this is a free site. Uh, these are the styles that, that a style maybe that we had made, but I could look for a new style. And if I say, well, um, you know, maybe I want something like this that'll match our website. So I use that style. And I can either choose to have it, the properties display in rows like this, where there's a property on a whole row, or in cards like this. And I can also put in custom CSS code. So once I'm done with that, I'll just put save. And this one, I just made the price red, just to use it as an example. And then I can copy that code. And I can put it anywhere on my website. In this case, we're putting it at JS Fiddle. And let's just run this. So you can see it's showing this, this code that I put in here. And then I can cruise through these images. So for example, if I say, well, what about this one? That's this property right here. Or if I say, what about this one? Oh, that's the one next to that. And it takes me to the property. If I move around, it actually updates the properties in the list. If I move like this, again, there's another update. So this allows you to load all of these uh, properties, show these to clients on your website, and then you can come back in here uh, on this dashboard and you can add custom code if, you, if you'd like to. You can change the settings. You can see how easy that is to switch now to rows. And uh, Again, if we're going to change uh, maybe a map color, say we want to do this light, go and select that as the option. And now, this may be cached on on this JS fiddle, so it may not update everything like we'd hoped, but it did. Uh, It did change the, the way the properties are laid out here. You can see that. This one's showing that MLS logo. You may adjust that using CSS. Anyway, this is a great tool, and I hope you enjoy it. And we are happy to set it up. This works for Wix. This works for Squarespace, for WordPress, for Duda, for Cargo, uh, Webflow, any any platform that works for the pure IDX sites. So enjoy.